Assalamu alaikum. Welcome back to the Crafty Bird. I hope you are all well and fine. Today's tutorial is about this beautiful planter. So let's get started. To make this planter, you need a ring which is 5 inches in diameter and I attached 11 cords by a uh, locks and knot here and now I am attaching 12 and final cord by locks and knot on this ring each cord is 140 inch long each cord is 140 inch long these are 12 cords and attached by locks and knot so let's continue We need to make square knots in this planter. Make square knots and we will make seven rows of square knots here.
so we will continue this pattern uh, we just uh, created a separation between these two and there is two parts of this planter now uh, this and this now continue this pattern so as you can see I just uh, made these two patterns here this one is uh, 14 inches from top to bottom and uh, this one is 10 inches from top to bottom as you can see I finished this with the pointed uh, v-shaped pattern pointed pattern and it's like 14 inches and uh, this one is 10 inches when we reach up to 10 inches uh, on this first pattern we will divide these two rows and you will start making this pattern here and here and this pattern will go on like 2 inches as we left on the above pattern of this under. so let's get started first pick these two So now you can see uh, these two are also getting separated uh, like this one we will make this pattern like 2 inches uh, just like as we did above on the planter. Finally uh, these uh, 3 rows are completed now. Take 10 inches uh, distance from this here and pick this one. need to pick extreme four cords from left and right and by leaving 10 inches distance we will make a square knot like so here uh, 10 inches distance are here so we took these cords they were like this straight you have to turn them this way straight turn them and take these two and three square knots. Now turn your work and carefully pick these cords. Three square knots. 
3. So we just completed our project today. I hope you love this planter. Please give me suggestions and feedbacks if any. That will be much appreciated. Till the next tutorial, please stay at home, stay safe and healthy. Good afternoon.